Hey, this is Danny Rom, and welcome back to Pokemon Friendship Red. So, not gonna lie, after watching that last episode, I am downright terrified to play this game. Poor Koopa Troppa. All you did was give. Even sometimes, you even gave us money when we needed money desperately. And then your life was cut short by a bay leaf with Zap Cannon. If only it wasn't Meganium, Meganium would have had Flame Wheel and we would have been fine. Anyway, let's make ourselves a new friend. We're gonna get the Magikarp and see if it actually is a Magikarp. An outrageous $500 for a cast form. Um, better than a sharp stick in the eye, I guess. I was hoping for a legendary or a fully evolved Pokemon or something just really useful there, but a free Pokemon is a free Pokemon. Didn't have to worry about catching that one. Let's see what we got. It is a fighting type and normal stats, has the ability run away, which is kind of nice, and psychic for an attack. So, all right, not the worst thing that, not the worst thing in the world. We'll take it, take the free one as it comes. So, the goal for the next, at least my segment, probably into Nick's segment as well, is essentially to get 10 steps to the right from here. There's a rock wall in the way. So we'll have to go through the entire dungeon that is Mount Moon first. Let's see what our wild Pokemon is. That Pokemon is... Nosepass. Okay. I can dig it, I can dig it. Rolling kick. Um, okay, that doesn't do too much damage. I'm so scared for Rock Snake. It has a defense that is 6, despite being at level 10, and despite being an Onyx. It's kind of weird that Onyx is so high in special attack, of all things. At least we have one good attack that makes use of it in Water Spout, but the thing is, Water Spout only has 5 PP, so once that's gone, then we're stuck to heckin' Astonish, neither of which is that great. But at least we catch the Nose Pass. I will name you. Hmm. Point me after the Harry Potter compass spell that honestly is not used that much. So, have another new friend. Let's see what this guy can do. This girl can do. An ice type with high defense, significantly higher defense than Onyx is. Uh, terrible speed, terrible attack. Which is probably why Rolling Kick didn't do that much to us. Also, we have Endeavor. Um, so, not gonna be too useful right now. Or possibly ever. It would need to get a special attack. The special attack was pretty usable, right? Yeah, pretty usable. Not great. At least the defense is high. Maybe it'll stick around for a bit. KM46 containing Metronome. That's pretty much redundant as all of this video is already effectively metronome. Um, yeah. Okay, so what I did was I adjusted the speed to 200%. I think that's going to be enough that we'll be able to get through the level pretty quickly. I don't want to edit anything out for you guys, like even these wild Pokemon battles, I don't want to edit anything out because I want to be accountable if a Pokemon dies on the watch, then I want you guys to see it and to know that, hey, I'm not trying to fix things here, everything is visible as is. So we just gave that Phoebus our ability of pure power that doubles its attack, that's not too great. Smelling Salt, Phoebus doesn't do much damage anyway because it's so weak. And it is super weak to ghost type attacks, apparently. Sableye. I think Sableye is also. Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> Alright, Man Webster? Really? Another Webster? That's like the second most common name for a guy after Veronica. Alright, she's waiting for her friends to find her here. And she's a cop. <laughs> An undercover cop. <laughs> Freeze! I'm a cop! Okay. Uh, Radita. So, I'm so scared about that Onyx's defense stat that that is the main reason why I'm switching out to just about all these encounters. I don't think the Onyx is going to last very long, honestly, but we'll try to preserve it as long as possible. At the very least, we'll get some KOs and get some experience for it. Um, 
I could try to train up Cassio. Actually, that's a pretty good idea. I'll try to train up Cassio. Get it to the point where that Psychic is usable. I don't see Nose Pass being of that much use, unfortunately. Oh, that might be a mistake. Bubble special, so whatever. I'll go with Hand with Water Spout. Um, not very effective. Okay. Uh, Astonish. Not very effective. Hydro Pump. Alright, let's get out of here. Anyway, I lost my train of thought. Um, yeah, I don't think Nose Pass is going to be very useful because its attack stat is just that disastrously bad and it only has a physical attack right now. We can try to potentially teach it a special attack later, but I'm afraid at that point we might as well just have better Pokémon that we can use that stuff on. Cassio... I don't think Cassio is going to gain experience that quickly either, so maybe we can go all in on Jelly Bob here. <laughs> Grudge, well, that's a miss, Jelly Bob. You can use a different attack than that. I wonder if we can learn that Rock Throw TM. Even Metronome would be better than that, actually. Cassio's ability to run away could actually be of pretty handy. Um, Metronome. Yeah. Why not? Why not? Actually, I know why not, because he has better things to do. Wait, no, I don't want it. Yeah, thanks. I'll give it... Can we learn Rock Throw? No, we can't learn Rock Throw. Onyx can learn Rock Throw. <laughs> Onyx can learn Rock Throw. I'll hold on to Metronome for right now. Servant Max with a Cloister? We're setting up a Calm Mine. At least we have physical attacks. Ooh. Ooh. Really? I hope we... Okay. Good thing we're still faster after that speed reduction. Otherwise, we might have been in trouble if we used another mud shot. Sweet. The... Being weak to rock is something that this poster also serves. Here comes a skitty. And that skitty is gone. Alright, no max your Pokemon will not do. Let's see, we got a spell tag, that's great. We'll be able to increase the spell tag increases ghost sight moves, and we have a pretty good ghost sight move in Shadow Ball, so now that just became even stronger. Yeah, we found a fire stone from earlier. I wish we still had Growlithe around actually to make use of it. Maybe Arcanine would be a little more useful. Um Okay, what do you got? Man, Veronica. Again? Really? There are too many Veronicas in this world. Too many Veronicas in my life. What? Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was way too close. That was way too close. Um, let's get Softwell back up. Please, Solarock, don't. Of it. Good, that doesn't take our item. <sighs> Alright, next time we see a Celio, be very afraid. Oh, man, this guy's using barrier. What a pain. What a pain. I don't know what attack he does yet. Roar. Okay, well, if he uses roar, then we'll switch him anyway. Okay, nice. Oh my god, that Celio using Explosion, my heart would have stopped. That probably would have been the game right there. Okay. okay. Alright, fine. <laughs> Kick Leon without color change. Flame Wheel, that's fine. Um, no, color change goes to the Growlithe that we aren't able to keep alive for whatever reason. Telling us about how tough Zubat is, sure. Another nose pass. Okay. 
let's see. I'm gonna get this item and then go back up through this area. Whoa! Oh! We found a master ball! Can we run into the roots that have Suicune and Regice and Meganium now? <laughs> All right. <laughs> everything is coming up Millhouse. Wait, everything is coming up Millhouse actually means you're having a lot of bad things happen to you. Nothing is coming up Millhouse. Everything is coming up great right now. We just lived an explosion. Cassio's run away is doing serious work running away from things. And we just found a Master Ball. Life is all right, despite the loss of War Turtle. Seriously, that explosion happened and my heart just stopped. Jelly Bob's, like, left tentacle, left tentacle, because he's a tentacle, also probably had just stopped. Venonat's on this floor. Um, gonna try to see what. Slack off. Okay, whatever. Cassio might be strong enough that we can let it try getting rid of some wild Pokemon, at least a few of them anyway. Um, yeah, I probably should be leveling up the other Pokemon a bit more, letting them do some work. Listening to the music go super fast is kind of cool. Here we go. Team Rocket, Pokemon Gangsters, striking fear with our strength. Rocker, Marshall. Well, you're actually pretty close, Randomizer. It's a rocket, but you call him a rocker. Relicanth. Um, Stockpile. They don't give bonuses in this one. In the later games, Stockpile actually both boosts your defense and special defense, like using a cosmic power. But. No dice in this game. There's no way it's going to have any of the moves that actually benefit from Stockpile, Spit Up, or Swallow. Alright, level 20 for Jelly Bob. He sends out a Flygon. I'll leave Jelly Bob in for right now. With the Switch versus st Set thing, I'm gonna leave it on Switch, but try actively not to um, use Switch. Wow, Flygon has Speed Boost. So. If we ever get into a position where we can catch a Trapinch, Vibrava, or Flagon, that would be pretty nice. Ah, poison. Good thing we have like 12 antidotes. Or 5 antidotes, whatever. Executor. Um, I'll use Soft Boiled. Where are you gonna do? Super Fang? Oh, that's bad. No, don't have Super Fang. That's lame. No! Alright, this is an uphill battle. If all he wants to do is Super Fang. Gonna go to Rock Snake. Good. It's probably fine. Super Fang does exactly half of your max HP for damage. Um, Water Spout was pretty underwhelming, so Executor must have a high special defense. I'm gonna try using Pecker Sonic to see if we can get, do anything better. Oh no. Okay. Well, it's a normal type. At least we figured that out. And it has beat up. Beat up Thunder Wave and Super Fang. That's his entire moveset. Okay. Uh, hmm. Okay. I will. Let's see. Jelly Bob can probably take a beat up. So, I'm gonna use an antidote to get it off the poison. Yeah. Use an antidote to get it off the poison, and then we'll go back to Jelly Bog. Get our HP back up with the Soft Boiled. Thank goodness we have Soft Boiled. I... Again, I'm gonna be so sad if something happens to Jelly Bob, and something almost did. Okay, we made it. <laughs> That was tougher than it should have been. Mirror Coat? That's a good attack. Sand Tomb? Moonlight? Where are these attacks coming from? 
What? <laughs> we just learned Moon... Miracle Santu and Moonlight in addition to Psychic. Okay, Moonlight is also a recovery move. So now we have two Pokemon that can recover moves. You know what? Cast form, not too bad. Maybe it is the best $500 that I've ever spent. Shoal Salt, that was not even worth it. War Turtle, I miss you. I miss you. Come back into my life. But don't come back too hard. Yeah, that was probably too much. See ya. Okay. I'm gonna go back up and heal and then try to make our way through the rest of the area. We're looking pretty weak right now. Yeah. I'm probably gonna end up breaking this. Well, I, I know already that I am gonna break end up breaking this into two segments. Nick will have to take the reins for the last one. Where we get all the way through it. Uh, I know one of the rockets in one of the lower floors had a level 16 Raticate, I think, in the original one, and that Raticate had Hyper Fang and caused all kinds of problems, so I'm kind of afraid what's gonna happen with this version, if it'll be a level 16 Raticate or something else. You know what? Let's fight some of these giraffe rigs. You wanna use Sweet Scent? That's fine. Our evasion is down. We're not gonna run away from your attacks any longer. Wait, what type is Cassio again? Fighting type, right. Okay. Ah, that's what you want. Okay, Liliana, she's an undercover cop. And as a Tropius. Oh, play it safe. Play it safe, go to Jelly Bob. That's just a motto of her life right there. Play it safe, go to Jelly Bob. You know. You know, Rock Blast, you can stand to cooperate every once in a while. Like that. See what happens when you cooperate? We get rid of a Tropius. And we have defeated the cop. Oh no, we haven't defeated the cop yet. Delcaddy. We just we just faced a Skitty. I forget what type of Skitty was. Anyway, see ya. Giraffe ring again. Cassio's at level, level 11 already. That's Maybe it is actually gonna like, gain levels relatively quickly, at least quickly enough. Yeah, that's, that's not bad. Really? Really? Another one? No, get out of here. Run away. Okay. We're gonna get Rock Throw and run into another War Turtle. I'm so sad. See ya. Pulling a big job here. Rocker Joe with the Sea King. Magical Leaf. Not something else to be scary about priority attacks. I'm so afraid of. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Wasted a soft boil there. Wasted another soft boil. Maybe I should stop pressing buttons. Anyway. That explosion left me petrified, was what I was going to say. And that seeking left me tickled, which is not the best scenario either. Um, my cargo sure, whatever, fine. I'll say everything in monotone, so that way it will sound like I'm disappointed with the world. Because I kind of was. Alright, there's a hidden item in this rock. Soothe Bell. You know, just in case our Pokemon get return or something like that. Okay, I'll fight this guy, and then the guy at the top of the stairs, and then... Ugh. See it. Um, and then we'll be done. Cassio's gaining some levels nicely. Um, 
Rock Snake. Oh no! <laughs> that was actually a good move right there. I'll switch to Rock Snake. Hopefully that'll be alright. Curse. Um. Well, okay. Let me use Water Spout. Super effective Fury Attack. Oh no! Stop! Okay. Good thing we killed it. It just occurred to me that it would do less damage because we had taken damage. Um, if we would have died to a Fury Attack, I would have been so sad. Um, Wingle, let's get out of here. Go back out to Jelly Bob, who is our MVP for the entire series. Just so nice to have Jelly Bob on our side. Rock Snake learned Jump Kick? Psychic... Oh yeah, not same type attack boost. Are we ever gonna get an ability that has same type attack boost? I would like to get an attack with Stab, that would be nice. You know, even if it's something weak, just to have something that makes a little bit of sense, that, that would be pretty nice for us. Um, let's use Soft Boil to heal our team. And we'll go up to get the item behind this hiker before battling him. X defend, sure. Oh, now we have an X defend and an XP. Alright, what do you got, bud? You shock me? I didn't shock anyone. He's a weightlifter, that's shocking me. Also with the name Zoe. I'm afraid that there might only be a few actual names in this randomizer. We've run into so many Veronicas and Websters. <laughs> can we not... Can we not confuse me? I'm already confused. This entire playthrough has me confused. Alright. Psychic's looking like a nice little 8-hit KO there. And he has Morning Sun. Um... Uh... And a sweet kiss. <laughs> Let's go back out to Tentacool. I don't want to deal with that life. No, not Nose Pass. Does that get rid of the Sand Yeah, it does. Okay. Seriously? It only has 5 PP. I can't believe we're getting into a stall war with a golem, despite using Water Spout on a golem. Ugh. No way! Why does this game hate me? Why does this game hate everything that I'm doing? Nope, nope, nope. I don't trust the golem. Seriously, stop doing that. Okay. Of course. Of course! At least we know it's attack. This attack is psychic. Oh yeah, we just- I just switched in a- That was avoidable. I switched in a fighting Pokémon to psychic. That's what I get for not thinking. Seriously, stop using Sweet Kiss! This is the worst. I'm actually gonna have to use a potion. I'm so scared that I'm using a potion right now. Instead of relying on soft boiled. I'm gonna do it again. I'll I'll do it again. You're You're triggering me here, Golem. You're making me make some inefficient decisions. Like hitting myself. That's definitely an inefficient decision. I think Rock Snake will be able to take Psychic if that's his only attack. Oh, yeah! Right. Cool. <laughs> But it's other only attack is like Sesame Toss. Um, that's fine. Keep Calm and Water Spout. Keep Calm and Pet. Keep Calm and Switch. He's not going to use Psychic because I had a Dark type on already. So now let's Soft Boil it up. And you get confused again by Sweet Kiss. Nope. We'll get Psychic instead. 
Let's soft weld up again, and now get confused by Sweet Kiss. Alright. God! I keep on forgetting these types. Thank you for hitting. Man, I didn't mean for this to take that long. And we're... Yeah. I'm going a little over time on this, so sorry about that. But... At least we're almost done with. Trico. See ya. Alright, everything about that golem was easy. So, we've made it. Surprisingly, everyone is alive right now. I'm gonna pass the reins to Nick. Hopefully everything will continue to be alive. I know that the last two times that you played, um, weren't as lucky in that regard, but hey, I had a really close call too, it very easily could have been me. Don't fault you at all for the deaths, just keep on playing confidently, and I know the good guys will prevail. Have a good day!